Hello everyone, Nils here and welcome to a brand new video showcase featuring Rathios. Bruh. Okay, I'm actually joking. It's Meliodas, the dragon sin of Wrath from the Seven Deadly Sins that came out last night with the update 10 of Anime Fighters. I actually happen to be quite lucky when it comes to getting this one. I got it about after an hour after the update went live with about six to six and a half thousand hatches, which is pretty lucky considering I never had a shiny mythical before. And I got my first Boros just yesterday after about 200,000 pulls on a city, which I think is kind of loading for a secret. So I definitely got like on this one. You can see it on the left of the screen here as I get it. All right, so I fed him some XP. We got 247 level, as you can see here. So let's see what this bad boy can do. In terms of looks, I don't know how I feel about um, the removal of faces. Came with the update. Not entirely sure about that. I think the, the face was definitely better. A stylistic choice. They say it's copyright though, so whatever. You see he has the purple black aura around him. He's carrying the sword. And he has the dragon sin tattoo on his shoulder. So he may not be strong on paper, but I think it's a pretty good unit. As you can see here, 175 level on a normal mythical that would be 24 billion. And the shiny, which is this one, it goes up to 42. So in terms of power level, it's not as strong. So if you want to compare it with uh, the Boro, this one, 147 currently, 1.9 billion damage. Emperor, 147, 2 billion, and obviously it's gonna scale much, much better. So as we said, 42 billion, and if we were to check uh, Emperor, it's 43. So it's pretty close still, but I think he's a better unit simply because he charges up his ultimate faster. I think it does, he does on five or six hits. Animation is also pretty good. You're gonna see it now. There we go, he's charging up. So he knocks him up to the air twice and then he just dunks the target down. Sometimes when he does the ultimate animation, the main target here disappears, but in most situations you just have two targets. You'll notice again he's gonna do it now. And let's see how many attacks it's actually taking him to do it. I think it was five or six. One, two. It's actually six, it's not five. All in all, a pretty cool unit. Can't wait until we get some crystals and pull four more of these to see how the crafted version is going to be and how strong it's going to be. I have the normal mythicals one, but unfortunately I don't have enough charge to do it. I couldn't solo the massive raid that came out about half an hour after the patch went live, so I have to wait for another one and then we're going to see. Anyway guys, I think that was it for this video. I hope you liked the showcase, Meliodas. I personally think he looked good and he seems to be a pretty good hero. A local down ultimate and it seems to do quite a bit of damage as well. Let me know in the comments about your opinions, whether you liked it or not, and about the patch in general. Although that is a quite a controversial topic. I think there is a lot of negative stuff about the patch and it came out but we'll see if there is any changes in the near future hopefully anyway guys if you like the video make sure to click the like button and subscribe as it will help me out a lot and until the next video take care